welcome to another video walk on the wild side and i am here in blackpool i am just opposite the north pier check it out the north pier it's a very busy day in blackpool today it's currently around about half past one in the afternoon there's lots of people around and as i turn around this way we've got talbot square the main square here in blackpool and just there we've got the town hall now we've got a protest plan for later around about three o'clock we're expecting quite a large crowd here it's one of many protests that's happening up and down the country and the police there's a lots of police around preparing for it as we can see if we look this way we've got some police here there's police cars all over the place we've got police car here have a look down this way we've got a load of vans checking it out feels a bit like there's a big football game on or something look at this i can hear someone singing happy birthday over there it's someone's birthday so look at this now there's three three vans here as you see blackpool this is market street by the way Three police vans there, look, they've got the. Hopefully, it won't. Hopefully, it will just be a protest and it'll be peaceful and it won't descend into to chaos like some of the, the other ones that we've had recently. But, uh, oh, yeah, they're, they're coming prepared anyway. But, um, I say, if I turn around, somewhere, I'm not sure if it's in one of these shops or. There's a, there's a, like a, um, you see that police car is there? They've actually got a little place in there, the police, the presence in town. This building here is the council, council built, connected to the town hall, so. Let's just have a little walk around here. We're seeing a bit of Talbot Square. There's lots of people waiting for the bus here. Here are all the, the main pubs. We've got the Weatherspoons. We've got Yates's. Brannigan's over there. Quite a lot of people around here. And just a bit, we've got some more police. Look at that. There's a massive presence in Blackpool. We've also, obviously, we've got the Rebellion Festival on as well. I don't know if I mentioned that before, but it's the third day of the Rebellion Punk Festival and just up here is the Rose and Crown which is a host a host venue for the Rebellion oh listen to this what an atmosphere I hope that this protest later on goes okay and it doesn't like I say it doesn't turn into a riot because it would put a bit of a, a spoiler on all this because obviously we've got the Rebellion Festival, which is, well, it's massive in Blackpool every, every year, thousands of people. This is Burley Street, by the way. It's rocking here at the Rose and Crown. Look at this. Sunshine as well. A nice day here in Blackpool. Let's hope it doesn't get spoiled later on. That guy there is wearing a bib with Tash on it because the Tash nightclub or the, the old Tash rock club was where we used to have, I believe they used to have the, the Rebellion Festival there. As you can see, we've got another van coming across there. Yeah, the, there's a massive uh, police. Kicking off in Blackpool. Oh, <laughs> well, we hope not. <laughs> How are you doing? All right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm just having a little bit of a look around. Yeah, kind of hoping that it doesn't kick off later on. Let's, let's, no, no, no. <laughs> I'll be thinking of you if it does. yeah, I might have to stay away. That's it there. Look, the police counter there. Look, they're a bit worried about that actually. They're a little bit worried about this uh, building here because there have been some, um, you know, some incidents where. The police uh, counters and all, you know, a lot of little police stations have been trashed, you know, so uh, we'll probably be looking for that later, looking after that later. But uh, this is 
This is called Corporation Street, and I'll just give you a look back down there. It's absolutely buzzing down there, yeah? Yeah, so someone was saying to me there, he said, he just said my catchphrase there, it's kicking off in Blackpool. Well, we don't want it to kick off today, though. So we'll carry on back towards Talbot Square again. So that building over there is the new Premier Inn. That's where Yates's Wine Lodge used to be, right there, yeah. Check it out. So, yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty busy. The tram's coming up here now as well. This is just a quick video just to give you a bit of a look around. Give you an idea of what's going on in Blackpool. on a Saturday afternoon as we await this uh, protest. You know what it's all about. I don't need to I don't need to say what it's about do I? I'll just have a look down here on the promenade. That's the counting house there. A very popular pub been here a long time. It used to be a bank, it was called I think it was a Midland Bank, wasn't it? Originally, red brick, like a Runcorn red brick, that isn't it? I think. So we'll just head towards. I want to show you something down here as well. We've got a car, that car there. That fancy, isn't it? Look at that. The end of the world is here. Interesting. Oh, look at all these people. Wow. It's pretty busy down here. By the North Pier. Got this chap here with the flags. And I just want to show you up here because we've got the Metropole Hotel now. It's uh, quite well known that the Metropole is uh, holding, well, it's holding um, Afghans, I believe, and as you can see, we've got uh, quite a heavy police presence here. We've got the mounted police here, and, and I think that they've come down here, obviously, because they're, uh, they might be expecting a bit of trouble down here, so they've got the mounted police down here by the Metropole. So there you go, that's the story in Blackpool. Let's have a little look at the sea, shall we? It's a nice colour. OK, so I'll just leave you with this, a view of the Irish Sea from Blackpool on a Saturday. And look at that. I don't know if you can see that, but that looks to me, it looks turquoisey. Right, nice colour. It's all to do with the wind direction as well, by the way. Yeah, so we're going to have a protest later on and hopefully it will pass off peacefully. We'll have to wait and see on that, but the police are definitely getting prepared for it. So that's it for this video. I hope you like it. If you like the video, hit the like button and also hit subscribe and tick the bell for notifications of new videos. And I'll see you again on the next one.